sewing a lab zipper placket. Lab zippers are often found on skirts at the waistband. A lab zipper is constructed so that the zipper is not visible. Learning to stitch lab zipper placket will help you while stitching usually lady skirts. Objective? At the end of this class, you will be able to stitch a lab zipper placket. Let us first familiarize with the tools and materials that you would need to stitch a lapped zipper placket. You would need cotton fabric, pattern square, tailor's chalk, straight pins, shears, a pair of small scissors, contrasting thread, zipper, iron box, sewing machine, measuring tape, seam ripper and zipper foot. Now let's watch how to stitch a lab zipper placket on a sample fabric piece. Step 1. Measure, mark and cut out the required sample fabric pieces. Measure and mark 14 inches by 6 inches squares on a double layer of cotton fabric with the help of a pattern square, measuring tape, and tailor's chalk. Use the shears and cut the marked square. Step 2. Mark seam allowance and position of zipper and pin two fabric pieces. Mark a 1 inch seam allowance along one of the cut edges of the wrong side of one fabric piece. Also mark the position of the zipper. Now pin the two pieces with the right side together with the marked seam line on the upper side. Step 3. Stitch the pieces of fabric. Start with the reverse stitch to prevent the seam from opening. Stitch along the seam line with a long stitch length up to the first marking of the zipper. Please note, here we are using a contrasting thread for demonstration purposes only, so that it is visible but otherwise one would use a thread matching to the fabric. Use the reverse stitch going 2-3 stitches back. Then change the stitching length to normal stitch and continue to the end. Now end with the reverse stitch to prevent the seam from opening. Snip the thread with a pair of small scissors. Remove straight pins. Step 4. Clip long stitches. Clip the long stitches every one and a half inch that they can be easily removed later. Step 5. Iron the seam. Open the fabric and the seam allowance so that the right side of the fabric is no longer together. Then press the seam open. For sewing this zipper, it is helpful to press the zipper flat. Under no circumstances should you place the hot iron directly on the coils or teeth of the zipper, they will melt. Step 6. Pin and baste the zipper. On the wrong side of the fabric, position the zipper on one side of the seam allowance. The zipper teeth should be directly over the seam line. Pin in place and baste the zipper to the seam allowance. From here, 
flip the zipper over to expose the right side of the zipper. Create a little fold along the teeth or coil with the same seam allowance that you just basted the zipper to. Pin in place. Step 7. Install the zipper foot into the right groove. Remove the regular foot from the machine and instead install the zipper foot into the right groove. Step 8. Stitch close to zipper teeth. Stitch close to the zipper teeth along the fold. Remove pin as you sew. When you finish sewing, snip the threads. Step 9. Remove the zipper foot and install it into the left groove. Remove the zipper foot from the right groove and install it into the left groove. Step 10. Top stitch the zipper foot from the outside. Turn the garment to the right side and pin the leftover seam allowance and zipper tape to the outer fabric and mark the length of zipper. Top stitch with a normal stitching length through all those layers around the covered zipper. When you finish stitching, Snip the threads using a pair of small scissors. Step 11. Remove basting and reveal zipper. Last thing to do is to remove the basting stitches and unpick the large stitches to reveal the zipper. With that, we come to the end of this class. Let's recall what we have learned. You learned how to stitch a lab's zipper placket. Let's review its basic steps. Step 1. Measure, mark, 
and cut out the required sample fabric pieces. Step 2. Mark seam allowance and position of zipper and pin two fabric pieces. Step 3. Stitch the pieces of fabric. Step 4. Clip long stitches. Step 5. Iron the seam. Step 6. Pin and baste the zipper. Step 7. Install the zipper foot into the right groove. Step 8. Stitch close to zipper teeth. Step 9. Remove the zipper foot and install it to the left groove. Step 10. Top stitch the zipper from the outside. Step 11. Remove basting and reveal zipper. You've now learned how to stitch a lapped zipper placket. Take our next class to learn how to stitch a fly front zipper placket.